Most people get the urge to deck the halls around Thanksgiving time, but for one Troy family, the holiday decorating strategy in spirit of giving is a year-long affair. It's merry, it's bright, and for Lisa Hicks, it's home. Christmas is my absolute fantastic and favorite time of the year. Lisa has four kids, 12 grandkids, two great grandkids, 19 Christmas trees, and a dedication to holiday decor that could arguably rival the North Pole. It takes about a good year to really get this together. I want to have peace in my home, and this is her absolutely favorite time of the year. So she's happy, I'm happy. The key to the magic, planning and strategy. You can look at these trees and you say, oh my, they look like they cost a lot of money. They don't cost a lot of money because I plan throughout the year for this. I'll wait to the end of the year, catch the bulbs for 80% off, and I'll start collecting. Lisa's months-long execution of this winter wonderland requires help from a local designer, friends, and family. Did you get to hang a few of the ornaments? Which ornaments did you hang? Do you remember? I hanged up some of the little lollipops and the little llamas. The celebrated love for the holiday born out of the love from her mother. I grew up very, very poor. It was 11 children, one Christmas. All of our toys came from the grocery store. My mother made sure that Christmas was the happiest time for us. That stuck with me. So throughout my entire life, I says, I'm going to make Christmas special for my children. But for the Hicks family, Christmas isn't just about the decorations, ribbons, tags, boxes, or bags. It's about the spirit of giving. And I called the shelter and the lady said, believe it or not, they do for the kids, but they never do for the women. And I almost started crying. I says, well, what I'm gonna do now is I'm going to provide gifts for the mothers. She's working with her church to make sure local mothers in need have a special Christmas too. I'm blessing the mothers. They will receive multiple gifts, multiple jogging suits, jackets, silk pajama sets, scarves, hats. She is a giver. I am a giver. If the Lord places you in a position that you can help, then you are obligated to help. And so in, in, in all of these decorations and everything that she does, that is not lost. Because for the Hicks family, helping others isn't just limited to a season. They say they're always lending a hand when they can, giving back through their church community. It's not about what you give, but just give. If, if, if all you can do is give somebody a hug, instead of horning in on what you don't have, horn in on what you do have, and then give what you can give. If it's nothing but I love you. Happy holidays. In Troy, I'm Alexandra Bahu, 7 Action News.